Yes. It's still. But you can't be any geek off the street. You gotta be handy with the steel if you know what I mean. Her. Keeping it real. Hello and welcome to the channel. My name is Steven and this is Steel Keeping It Real. So you know what today is. Just another mashup. That's right, it's Mashup Monday. And on this day, I go on YouTube and try to find some of the best mashups that are out there and present them to you guys. Now, this week, I'm very happy to be doing these ones. They seem to be very, very good ones so far. And this is the last one of the evening. Now, I this one I'm doing is Dolly Parton, Brandy, and Monica. And Brandy and Monica's the Boy Is Mine, and Dolly Parton, Jolene. Oh, okay, Jolene! So, you would think, like, uh, really, country and R&B? Yeah. But, you know, country and R&B normally does work. You know, look at, look at Lionel Richie and some of his works, like Ceylon, and uh, there's another one. Um... Ceylon is, is probably the biggest one. Ceylon down the line, half a mile or two. But you know, you have you have Lionel Richie, who also wrote for Kenny Rogers. You know, uh, Lady. Uh, so you know, R and B and country do mix, maybe because they have some of the core elements of them being out of uh, you know sort of poverty type of, of music, whether it be bluegrass or, or something like that, and getting, you know, into a little bit more pop country uh, that happened in the 50s. And, uh, yeah, that a lot of those people who do sing country can sing other songs. I mean, Olivia Newton-John was really doing country with Have You Ever Been Mellow and uh, Let Me Be There in the Morning. You know those kind of songs so it it, it, does, it it can work and I'm hoping that this works uh, if you like videos like this and others on my channel please don't forget to hit the like button the subscribe button and the notification button because I'm doing at least 15 videos each and every week so without any further ado here is Dolly Parton Brandy and Monica Jolene, the boy is mine. And here we go. Excuse me, can I please talk to you for a minute? Uh-huh. Sure, you know. You look kind of familiar. Yeah, you do too. But um, I just wanted to know, do you know somebody named... You know his name. Oh yeah, definitely. I know his name. But I just want to let you know that he's mine. <laughs> no, no. He's mine. Jolie, Jolie, Jolie.
it? Hold on. 12 seconds later. I want you guys to know I'm very disappointed that the video ended like that. It was great. It was a great mashup and I was trying hard to, to believe that this was working so well. And when I go back and look at what I downloaded and the actual original, it's only two minutes and something seconds long. But how are you gonna leave it like that without fading it out? On. At least, you know, give us an indication like, hey, this is almost over. You know, I a lot of times I don't look at the time, you know, because I don't want to have to keep thinking like, Shh, is this song going to be over? Oh, I just have to wait for this. But no, it was working great. I want you to finish it. This is from somebody called I Complexity. I want you to finish that. Really? Because it was great. Um, the, 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 other, the underlying factor, not only is it a mashup, but it's like Jolene, this boy is mine. It's almost the same thing that Dolly Parton is singing about, that Brandy and Monica are singing about. It's like, you know, this is my man. No, this is my man. Don't take my man. Jolene, don't take my man. You know, it all worked together so well, but to end it only after two minutes? It just leaves it sour. But it was good while it lasted. I will tell you that. It was good while it lasted. And had it gone through, it would have gotten something like, where'd you find this? Or, damn, this shit is dope. I would have put that on this one because this was working so well. You know, you guys will have to say it, or do you agree or disagree? I thought it was working so well, but um, there's nothing I can do about that. I wish. I, I actually, from the time period that you see me with headphones to not, that's like a good, you know, minute where I'm going back online trying to find the original video that I downloaded and then I see at the bottom it said two minutes and seven seconds and I'm like, you know? So, um, if you are still here, I thank you very much for staying tuned. I really do appreciate it. Sorry about the video, but we were on a roll tonight. The only problem was technical, you know, with my my system. And this video is going to have a watermark on it too, I think, because of, um, I don't know why. I, again, I have to talk to somebody and talk to somebody, not just chat with an AI. Uh, or somebody who's just reading from a script. Uh, I, I can't stand that. And I don't even work that way with the job that I do because I know in the years, all the years that I've been working that nobody wants to talk to a robot. Uh, not an AI robot or even a robot uh, of somebody who's just reading from a script who's not taking into effect maybe a human factor or a desperation factor or something like that. Because that's what had happened with, with me earlier today and why it took me so long to make these videos is that I had to talk to my bank because they had, they had me with $60 worth of overdraft fees and I was like, no. And the two people I spoke to uh, first, they were saying they're supposed to be there and sir, you should read your, your terms and agreements. Of, of the, I was like, wait a minute. I don't think I have to do that. Um, because... Um, I know that I didn't overdraft. I put $150 into my checking account right before I went out shopping yesterday. So I didn't spend $150 worth of stuff yesterday. So, uh, yeah, they had to fix that. And then by that time, it was too late to call up one to share. But at the same time, I put money into the account so I could go ahead and do uh, buy my one to share at a certain time. So that's all the problems that I, I had to deal with. So if you're still here, I thank you very much for staying tuned. I really do appreciate it. First and foremost, I want you guys to like the videos as much as I like making them for you. After that, all you need to do to help me out with the channel is to like, subscribe, share, and comment.